Hi guys, Dave Anderson here, Helicool's Helipad. So you say you got water in the engine oil? Well, it's one of two things. You better hope that it's one and not the other. Stay tuned. All right, so we checked the oil the other day and it looks like chocolate milk. I mean, look at that nasty chocolate milk stuff. It's hideous. Now, one of two things happened. Either you didn't run it very often and condensation will build up. You know what? You can probably just run it for a while. It'll steam that out. And uh, But I would, I would definitely recommend changing the oil after that. However, it could be a blown head gasket and is leaking antifreeze into the oil. Now on the very tip of your tongue, that's where you would taste sweet. So I'm gonna take a drop of this, put it on the tip of my tongue. I'm gonna have a rag ready because this is not gonna be pleasant. If it is sweet, I'm screwed. I'm gonna have to change the engine. If it is not sweet, it just tastes like yucky oil, then I have a reasonable shot at bringing this car back to life. So what are we waiting for? Let's find out. Okay, nastiness. It's not pleasant, but you know what? It's not sweet either. <laughs> I think this might be a salvageable vehicle. <laughs> yes! Woo! -hoo -hoo -hoo. <laughs> All right, so that is how you do that test. You got some nasty, milky looking oil. And uh, if it tastes sweet, you're screwed. If it doesn't taste sweet, then you might be all right. I think I'm gonna be all right with this. Praise Jesus, praise Jesus. Until next time, I'm Dave Anderson signing out. You guys be safe out there, and God bless. If you have confirmed that it is water and not antifreeze, run your car for 20 minutes, shut it off, then change the oil and filter, and continue to monitor.